Hi, this is Chris from Lamello, and in this video I'm going to show you some basic, simple, best practices for using your new Zeta. It's always recommended that we uh, use dust collection with the Zeta, it just keeps things cleaner, better quality cut, and also we don't want dust building up in this bottom cassette and interfering with the vertical mechanical drives travel up and down on the Z-axis. So it's just really simple, plugging in the, the dust uh, hose into the dust stub. I'm going to make a simple mitered connection here. This is at 45 degrees. However, if this was a compound angle, it's very easy to find the angle by putting the flip stop onto the workpiece and dialing the zeta down until it indexes onto the beveled surface you want to cut. In another video, we'll show you how to do uh, mitering from the long point. Anyway, so I'm going to be working on a, a short point miter, so I'm going to use my four millimeter spacer plate, which comes with every zeta. I'm really just showing this to you to show you a, a basic feed rate. Now this is really uh, light material, and it's MDF, there's not going to be a lot of resistance. You'll see how quickly the vertical mechanical drive works. In dense material like white oak or rock maple or solid surface, the vertical mechanical drive will click up and down much more slowly. The point is you just don't want to rush it. You want to let the machine finish doing its job. So, and the other important thing, especially when working on miters, is that you want to push straight in and out along the ways of the machine. You don't want to jack it or ramp up in either direction, just very easy pushing in and right along the ways of the machine. And so this is a good typical feed rate. Let the machine spool down. That's it, you don't want to jam it in and there's no reason to go particularly slowly either. Other than that, basically it's just like using a, a fancy biscuit joiner. If you use those before, you're gonna be fine using this. Thanks for watching, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and like this video.